New tonight, to the moon and back. NASA's Orion capsule has already been up in space. Where is it now? Sandusky, Ohio. It's undergoing testing at the Neil Armstrong test facility to help researchers prepare for the next Artemis mission. 13 Action News reporter Alexandria Manthe has the story. This capsule is set to go through even more rigorous testing that can only happen here in Sandusky, Ohio. Just over two years ago, this capsule was in space. This is actually the Artemis 1 spacecraft that two years ago did a 25 day uncrewed mission around the moon. It's traveled 1.4 million miles in space. Now it's at the Neil Armstrong test facility where NASA's researchers are testing its abilities to withstand the elements. This includes testing in an acoustic chamber where the Orion is essentially blasted with sound to make sure it will withstand noise at top speeds and any explosions. You can think of many jackhammers going off or a really loud rock concert, put two or three rock concerts together. They're also testing the abort scenario to ensure crews inside can make it safely back to Earth in case of an emergency. Anything that we learn from Artemis 1, anything that we learn from the environmental test article here gets applied to Artemis 2 and then to future missions. It's the only place in the world that can do this testing. And the road to the moon does go through Sandusky, Ohio, and it has, and that's what's going to get our astronauts to the moon safely. The last Artemis test mission didn't have any crews on board, but the next one will have four people inside. Artemis 3, set for 2026, will land humans on the moon again. After that, NASA officials say the possibilities grow. You look at that, you see one of the elements that eventually is going to help us get to Mars. Testing in Sandusky will wrap up in December and the capsule will be sent to the Kennedy Space Center in Florida. After that, you may be able to one day see it for yourself. It's going to end up in the Smithsonian someday. So you'll be able to take your family to the Smithsonian and say, hey, that vehicle went through Sandusky, Ohio. <laughs> Alexandria Manthe, 13 Action News.